oras ang bahay dahil nga po ang month ng August ay sight-saving month. Ipapakita po namin sa inyo ang pinaka-latest na technology when it comes to basic treatment. Available po dito sa Pilipinas na matatagpuan sa Fatima Eye Laser Center. At ito nga po ang kinatawag nilang SMILE or Small Incision Lenticose Extraction. Alamin natin, ano nga pa ang kagandahan at kaibahan ng prosesong ito kesa sa mga iba pang mga surgical treatment procedures na available po dito sa ating bansa para matulungang maibalik ang dating ganda at linaw ng ating mga paningin na tinatawag nga nilang windows of our soul. Yan po ang ipapaliwanag at ipapakita sa atin ng isang magaling na eye expert, sikat na sikat po dito sa Pilipinas. Walang iba, si Dr. Vic Santos. So we're set up already. Naglagay na po tayo ng adhesive tape for the eyelashes. Already placed a speculum para to keep the eyelids open. At mapapansin nyo, uh, meron po tayo ditong special uh, corneal interface. It's a plastic cup. no? Uh, simple plastic cup, pero yan po ay napaka-vital sa success ng ating surgery. Because as you can see, I will be docking the, I will be docking the eye to that cup para sigur, masigurado na hindi ho gagalaw yung, yung mata po. Ay, ayan po, unti-unti na ho natin uh, dinadock yung mata. It has to be aligned perfectly so that the laser will be accurately placed. No? On, okay, ganyan ang tingin, Melissa. Pag malapit tayo, pag malapit na dumikit, wag ka na gumalaw, ha? Okay, so we will... Open both eyes. Open both eyes. Okay. Huh? Sakto tayo. Sakto tayo. Okay, so I'll just go straight. Try not to adjust anymore with your eyes. Kami na bahala mag ano. Don't move. And you can see the eye, no? We'll have, uh, we'll have bubbles, no? Now the femtosecond laser is now active. Makikita niyo po dun sa camera na meron pong mga bubbles. Yan lang po ang tumatama sa mata ni Marisa. But there will be two layers. One is for the inferior layer, and the other will be for the superior layer, creating a lenticule. Tapos so meron pong isang maliit na hiwa sa gilid, dun po, dun po tayo kukuha ng lenticule. No? Okay, so successful po ang ating pag, pag-laser. Okay, at ang, at ang next step na lang po natin ay ang pagtanggal ng lenticule. Okay, so, so I'll just be creating an optical window para si Marisa may makita, no? may light ka makikita. Doon ka lang po-focus, ha? Are we at 0.6 or 0.1? Okay. Okay na tayo. 1.6. Are you in 1.6 or 1? 1.6. 1, 1, 1. 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1
Tapos po, magdadaysek na lang po tayo. Kita niyo po, natatanggalin na po natin ang lente. Tapos na po ang procedure sa first eye. Lilipat na po tayo sa kabilang mata po, no? Okay. So, tandaan niyo lang yung ginawa natin kanina. Uulitin lang natin yan, ha? Ito po ang suction cup. It's a very important uh, connection no, between the laser and the eye of the patient. Pero unlike other technology, ma mahina lang po ang suction niya para hindi tumaas ang pressure sa loob ng mata. No? So that the level is always constant and accurate. At papansinin niyo po no, that the focusing of the laser is actually dependent on the bed. Okay, okay. Fixed, fixed ano lang po siya. Fixed focal point lang siya. Pero yung bed ho ang nag, ano, no? Ang nag adjust Okay, just to look straight, Marisa. Open both eyes. Try to look straight. Oh. Try, to, try not to have any of those, ano? Uh, jerky movement sa eye, no? Kung anong tingin niyo ngayon, doon na lang po, no? Oh, try not to find it. Just keep your eyes straight. Kami naman mag adjust Okay, makikita nyo ulit no, na magkakaroon ng bubbles yung cornea. Slightly inferior and temporal and nasal. Ayan po, nakikita nyo dito sa camera ito. May mga bula pong nakikita. Yan po yung first layer and then a few seconds after the second layer. And then as a final ano, incision, yung pong pagkukuhanan ng lenticule. Okay? So, successful po ang ating pag-laser. So, you will, yeah, you, the, the bubbles are actually uh, those that are created by the femtosecond laser. I'm creating an optical window para si Marisa may ilaw na makikita at makatingin siya ng diretsyo. No? Okay, ngayon, that, the task now is removing the lenticule. Sa sandaling procedure na po yun, ay mababago na po ang grado ni Marisa. Maglalagay lang po kami ng eye drops. At yun na po ang procedure ho, no? Done? Done na po. Okay po. So, siguro pwede ka na po tanggalin ng aking mask. Yes, okay. Thank you so much. Grabe ito. I'd like you to get a picture of Marisa's smile. Natapos na. How do you feel? How do you feel? How do you feel? Ah, okay. Give a smile for us. But if you have a smile, you can do it. I can go back to work. Yes, you can go back to work. It will take about two to three hours before she gets some clarity. But now, you can see a little different. If you have no salamin, and now you have a laser. May konting-konting improvement na. Yes. Ah, ah, yeah. Alaga lang gagawin nila, ipatak ang gamot sa oras. Mm -hmm. Hindi na ho kailangan mag-alala na kahit i-rub niya. Although, da, lagi namin, ano, lagi namin sasabi, huwag i-rub dahil baka magkaroon ng infection. Pero yung other risk of rubbing, mm -hmm. causing the movement of a flap, hindi ho mangyayari sa smile. Dok, hindi ko napansin any stitches at all. Wala tong uh, stitches. Well, in all refractive procedures uh, involving lasers, mm -hmm. Whether it's PRK, LASIK, uh, femtolasik, or SMILE, wala talagang tahe. Mm -hmm. Kusa lang pong naghihilang mata. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. okay. At uh, lastly, doctor, invite our televiewers to once again visit you here sa hospital niyo para dun sa mga taong pong uh, mag gustong mag-goodbye sa kanilang mga glasses. Apo. Uh, try naman uh, po ang LASIK clinic. Nandito po ako sa Fatima Eye Laser Center. Araw-araw, during weekdays, yeah. Tapos po ang aming uh, uh, telephone number is very easy to remember. Alalahan niyo lang po ang 291 and the other four numbers are 2020. Kasi yun po ang goal namin, our patients to reach a vision of 2020. Okay. So 291-2020. All right. Salamat marami once again. Ah, thank you. Dr. Vic Santos, ang presidente po ng Fatima University Medical Center. Ayan, okay mga kasambahay for time. My staff should join me. This is Christian and Paul. Ito na po, immediately after the surgery, 
Nakatayo na po ang ating pasyente na si Ms. Maris. And of course, andito na rin po ang kompletong staff ng uh, Fatima University Medical Center Laser Department. Yes. Right? Okay. <laughs> At siyempre, Sounds kasama right. natin si Dr. Vic. <laughs> uh, At uh, nakita po natin, very successful. Salamat ng marami sa Diyos. It is really a very interesting, spectacular, awesome. awesome. Uh, salamat, Dr. for Hi, anytime. Me. My pleasure. It's very Thank nice technology yeah. sa ating bansa. So, para mas marami nice. talagang... Uh, matulungan pang mga kababayan natin na magkaroon ng malinaw na paglingit sa pamamagitan ng mga technology na ganito. Doctor? Thank you! Thank, thank you! So you. My pleasure! Thank Ayan. you! Thank you! Salamat! Thank you! Thank you! Thank you! Salamat! Okay! You're okay? We're okay? I'm okay! Ayan mga kasabay! Salamat po na marami sa Diyos once again! Yan muli ang naging pag-aksyon ng ating mga doctors sa ating segment na Doctors in Action! At yan po mga kasambahay ang action ng doctor natin sa Doctors in Action. Maraming salamat kay Dr. Vic Santos and especially to Fatima University Medical Center. Hello to Ms. Lynn Perez. Nami-miss ka na namin, Ms. I Lynn. I miss you, Mami Lynn. <laughs> so Doc, very quickly na lang, yeah. ano ba itong smile procedure? Small incision lenticule ek extraction? Yes. Uh, ang ginagawa? Uh, um, na-discuss natin kanina umaga, uh, kanina pala, sorry, na kailangan baguhin ang shape ng cornea. And we do that by uh, taking away a lenticule that is equivalent to the refractive correction. Oh. The, it makes use of a special laser called a femtosecond laser. No? Oh. The femtosecond laser, a femtosecond is one quadrillionth of a second. Napakabilis po niyan. Oh. It's beyond the uh, matter's reaction time to heat. So hindi ho nag absorb ng heat. What is created are just bubbles. It's very precise bubbles, and very accurate. Yeah. Just bubbles, and then the 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 lenticule is dissected with a blunt instrument. Mm -hmm. No sharp, oh. no sharp blades yeah. are used. Yeah. 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 So it's very very safe. Uh, uh, very 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 uh, uh, non-traumatic, and it's very very quick. And patients are able to get mm. off their glasses or contact lenses immediately, immediately, immediately after the procedure. Yeah. Masakit po ba ito? Uh, hindi siya masakit dahil meron siyang uh, anesthesia while we're mm. doing it. And then the, the patient doesn't feel anything afterwards. Mm. Okay. And it's permanent. The improvements are long term. It, it's long term but there's such a thing as regression uh, oh. in all laser procedures. But uh, this is uh, minimally so because it's more biomechanically stable. Mas stable ang pag paggawa ng refraction kung maliit lang hiwa instead of the usual large flap that is created yeah. with laser. Nice. Good news yan para sa ating mga kasambahay na naka-glasses. Pwede na silang mag-ano, mag-glasses. Tsaka, you know what, yung patient natin, less than 3 minutes, parang 2 and a half minutes lang siya. Oh. So in one day, and dami yung magagawang procedure Marami. na ganyan. No? Uh, um, oh, yeah. <laughs> sana, <laughs> sana. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Sana tanggapin ng ating publiko ang itong uh -oh. procedure na ito. Okay. Kasi yung mga kinakatakutan nila dati na may blade at may hiwang malaki, uh -oh. eh, wala na po ngayon. Tsaka tama so, yung sinasabi ni Doc, no? Yung laser na to ay eh, hindi mainit. Mm -hmm. Hindi pa siya mainit. Kinakatakot ng iba, oh, laser yan, oh, di ba? Oh, yung laser mainit. na gano'n, oh, no? nagihiwa ka in everything. Oh, hindi daw ito yung mainit. Very quick procedure, Very painless. Very quick and painless procedure. Nakita nyo naman yung patient natin, di ba? Nakangiti pagkatapos. <laughs> Kasi smile ang pangalan ng procedure. Oh, smile. <laughs> so, Doc, thank you very much. You've been a big help. Uh, thank like you. Thank you for helping Ma'am Marisa. Uh, laki ng tulong talaga. Any final tips po for our audience? Oh, well, uh, uh, inaanyayahan ko po kayo na magpa-check up once a year uh, sa lahat ng ophthalmologist po. No? Uh, kapubuti po natin lahat yan. Mm -hmm. At kung maaari kami makatulong sa pamamagitan ng laser, well, don't hesitate to call us. We'll be there for you. Wow. Again, thank you very much, Dr. Vic Santos. Maraming maraming pong salamat. Fatima University Medical Center. Ang number ulit, 291-2020.